Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I wanted to kind of touch on something that most of us know that's going on currently, a case that's um, being talked about by a lot of people. Most of you may be familiar with it. Um, the Carly, Carly Russell case. Um, I guess when this, you know, when this case first came out or whatever, I mean, we have a connection to it in a couple of different ways. One being that, um, you know, I too am a, a parent and um, I'm also from Birmingham, Alabama. Well, in this video, I won't go into any speculation or anything like that as far as what I think may have happened. That's not really the purpose of this video. But I do want to kind of touch on, like, from a, the standpoint of as parents, because um, many of you may be familiar with the fact that uh, the police have come forward to say that, you know, there's not enough evidence to support some of the things that have been said regarding, you know, what some may have thought took place. Okay, so with that being said, as a parent or as you know someone who has been in a parental role or you have loved ones that are children like what do you do now moving forward how do you handle everything that's going on i mean because you know even though this lady is an, as an adult she's still a child of someone and how do you You know, what do you do? Do you, you know, just continue to stand on the side of um, I'm supporting my child, you know, not to say that you don't support your, your children, but in terms of continuing to believe, you know, what's being said about a child. Do you do that or what? Do you throw your hands up? I mean, you know, and just say you deal with this on your own. It's, it's your situation. I don't necessarily think that you would do that. You don't know, just not support them, but it's just a hard situation to deal with. And I guess, you know, if you haven't been in that situation, you don't really know how you would deal with it, but just kind of, just kind of thinking, you know, because it, it's, it's a lot that's currently going on and will still continue to go on in the days to come. And I know at some point, this will be over. Um, it won't be talked about as much. But um, if you saw my last video, I was just talking about, you know, raising um, children today as opposed to, you know, when I was a, a kid. And so this is kind of still in line with the whole parenting topic. Just as a parent, how do you deal with that, with with everything that's going on? This is a lot. I mean, it's, it's garnering a lot of attention. So... I mean, I could have just only imagine what they're having to deal with at this point, but yeah, uh, I believe it is, it's a lot, but yeah, that's my question. So as, as a parent, how do you deal with everything that's going on? If this were your child, how would you, how would you deal with it? If we haven't been in a situation similar to this before, yeah, we might not just no, we can only speculate how we would handle a situation like that. But it is something to think about and something to discuss. So, yeah, let me. I'd like to know what your thoughts are. Uh, leave a, a comment and let me know how do you think you would deal with this situation if it were you as a parent dealing with your child being in a situation such as the one that's currently going on. So, yeah, thank you for watching. Um, I appreciate any comments or feedback. And until the next video, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.